Hello guys and girls and welcome back. So let me pick up this stone because we have room for just this stone in our inventory. I mean our inventory is pretty much full and let us descend this ladder. An injured dwarf lies on the ground before you, nearly unconscious from his wounds. So we are going to tend his uh, wounds. Having regained his strength, the dwarf thanks you. You have saved me. Okay. So. Okay, so he wants to join our party and we are going to accept that. Stagor joins your party, he says. During the battle, I chased my enemy up a staircase to this level. Okay. So now we have Tagor, a dwarven warrior, when I'm not mistaken. Uh, he's a fighter, dwarf male. And I think he's better than uh, my character, because I am a level 3 fighter and he should be a level 5 fighter, when I'm not mistaken. And it is so. So we are going to cure his wounds. like that. I'm going to give him uh, my shield and I'm going to play as a backup character from now on I think. Also I could use the bow. Acid arrow. Let me see if we can... Uh, can we scribe something? You don't have any scrolls. Okay. Pray for spells. We have Bless, we have Cure Light Wounds, we have Eight, we have Hold Person, Slow Poison. Slow Poison is very important on this level, I think, because uh, yeah, there are spiders like roaming uh, these corridors and they can poison you, and they will usually, so it is like really hard to do something or, or just uh, not to get hit by those attacks. Memorize, armor, magic missile. Okay, so I think that's all. We are going to rest. Will it be 50 hours? No, just 35. That's good. Okay, so now we can continue. We cannot go this way. Oh, this wall is moving. It is moving around the center part, so... I think we need to set it to be like this. And now we should be able to pull this. Special quest for this level. What is this? Aces control lever. Okay, so this opens and closes that pit. And we have found, I think this is a plus 3x draw cleaver. So let me equip Tagor with it. Also, this, uh, this chain should open a passage. Uh, yeah, you can carry this for now. I don't know what this does, but uh, what is it? Aces control lever. So I think uh, the, the inscription is the same as uh, uh, in the room with those uh, not traps, but uh, there were like openings in the floor. So I think uh, this thing does get rid of them. And yeah, this is the passage that appeared uh, when we have pulled the, the chain. Crew and the f fearless one. So now pretty much we can go through this, can we actually? Yeah, we need like we need like one more lever or something to deactivate this one. 
we already pulled on that one so yeah that opens uh, that passage and there is nothing here oh this is just a normal maze And I think this is the switch uh, to deactivate the last uh, opening in the floor. Nothing here. Okay. This is the last one and again a maze. I think this is just a regular maze so we don't need to do anything with it pretty much. Is there something here? No one is able to pry this door open. I think this is... Uh, uh, you can access the door from the other side and this is like a way out from an area where the spiders do spawn and live. So we cannot open it from here. And I think uh, yeah, there should be a spider behind this door when I'm not mistaken. Can we use the armor? I'm going. To, I'm. I'm going to cast everything because those spiders are su are such a. They are like so annoying, really. Mist, mist. Don't poison me. How am I missing my attacks? Come on. Okay, so that went well. First spider is out of the way. But I don't think there is anything here. Or is it? No, nothing here. We can go through this room pretty much and that would like... Uh, yeah, we can open the door. But if we go through the pressure plate, the door will close behind us, so I do not want to go there just yet. Okay, this is the area where the spider was. So we are going back to the beginning, like here now. This passage should be open. Yep, it is. Okay, so, so far so good. Oh, spider! No, 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 no! Uh, what I find annoying is that uh, if you, like, uh, use those stones and everything that you can, like, throw and... Uh, at the enemies then you have to pick it up and uh, you have to really like micromanage or uh, you have to do so many clicks like to pick it from the ground it's quite annoying and what are those potion of cure poison these are like very important uh, on this level i think because yeah because of the spiders What is here? Nothing. There is an inscription. Oracle of Knowledge. I think uh, this can identify our items, but yeah, we need to like use an item. I don't know which item just yet. We will see later in the game because uh, I think those are portals, these openings. Uh, we are missing something that is in this slot and we can then access this level again. So yeah, okay, let's go this way, a key, can we, can we actually pick uh, this lock, let's see, ah, we have picked the lock, very nice, and this is just, uh, yeah, this just opens the door from the other side, a 
door opens, uh, door open, door close, items come, items come, item go. I think if we open just uh, from this, oh, spider, if we just open from this uh, position, then uh, uh, the potion will, will spawn there. But if we open it from any other position, ah, okay. Very nice, so that it does the trick, I guess. Now let's close and let's try this way. Yeah, it spawns those potions, so that is like very, very nice. I didn't even know about it, but yeah, why not? If the game gives us those potions, we are going to use them. So, very nice. One more. No, that, that was all. And I think there is a secret passage right through here. Yep. Like that. And that opens uh, a passage uh, like uh, near the beginning of the level. Okay, we have to get out of here like this. But this just, this should open. Yeah, th this is the opening. This is what it did. This is this is the secret wall that disappeared because of that switch. Now, yeah, let's go down here. What oh, way is the ah? We need the key here. Okay. Going south. Just an empty room. And this one is empty as well. Anything behind this door? No, nothing. Ah. Okay, I do, do not know what this does again, but why not? I think this is the exit from this level already, but we do not want to leave just yet. Okay, nothing here as well. I think there should be a room somewhere to the east, but yep, this, this is what we are looking for pretty much. It is hard to see, but there is a button on the wall like this and this opens uh, this room and we have found a dwarven helmet dwarven helmet i think we have helmets everyone has a helmet yep and a shield dwarven shield very nice Yeah, maybe I should like keep the items like here. Can I? Nope. But I can keep rations there. You cannot put an item there. Okay. Game. Whatever. Whatever you say. <laughs> <coughs> so yeah, let us exit this room. Now we are going to a part which I do not like at all. We are going east, yep. Okay, let us open this door. And this is the same like same situation as we were. If we go through the pressure plate, the door will close behind us. And this is the area with the spiders. So maybe I should just rest here and uh, replenish the spells. Yeah, let us rest. Okay, part is restored. <sighs> Nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, I'm going to cast Bless and Armor on my front line. Also, if we can get if we can fire that magic missile, it will be nice. Nothing here just yet. 
And there is a spider already behind the door. Should we go there or should we not? Ah, let's try. That was lucky because he hit us and I'm not poisoned. I do not know how lucky that was. And this is uh, an area like uh, this opening above us is to level 3. So we could have fallen down here. From the previous level pretty much. Uh, one more rock. And we have found an arrow. But yeah, the time is like running really fast, so I think uh, I will just cut it here and yeah, see you in the next one. So thanks for watching, bye bye.